Guys, what's up? I've just unboxed like all of my Assassin's Creed gear from a new Assassin's Creed Syndicate um, collector's edition. So I'm going to go through it and show you guys this stuff because it's rather awesome. So the w lighting might be a bit weird, it's getting darker and darker by the second. I've tried filming this a few times and it didn't work out very well. So here we go. I was using one hand to film and one hand to unbox stuff and it didn't work very well. Um, so here is the statue. I don't know if you guys can see very well, but there you go. Look at this magnificence. That is such a cool statue, and the bottom of the statue kind of looks like that. It's a bit dark in here, but let me bring it out a minute so you guys can see. Look, it kind of looks like that with the Assassin's Creed symbol on it. Um, and then we have um, the map. So if I unfold the map, like so, we've got some, uh, like, I don't know what this is, just some sort of like promotional thing from within the game. And on the other side is a map of London with it from the, from the game. So this map could be, I think they based this off like the actual Victorian maps from the time. Is obviously when they make the Assassin's Creed games, they take historical periods of time and then research them and research them and research them and then build the game around that period of time. So this is the map, which is rather epic, I must admit. I would love if it was blown up, maybe a more detailed version of it. Next we have the art book. Now the art book is rather cool because inside the art book you get a lot of um, like scenery shots and like there you go, there's the gauntlet for instance and then the uh, cane, some pistols, other characters, there's Eve, there's, I can't remember what his name is, that's the main guy um, and that's Evie kind of thing and then there's another picture there. I don't know if I'm doing too well on this. Um, I'm left-handed, so <laughs> issue. Right, so that's that. This is the soundtrack for the game. So there's lots of nice music on there. And last of all, is the actual game. Which I've actually got the uh, Darwin and Dickens um, conspiracy mission on here. There's also two extra missions for download. I think it is on the box as well with this edition. So there's like two extra missions on here, which is rather epic as well. Um, that's pretty much it with uh, the unboxing. I The great thing about this game is, as well, I'm getting a new graphics card soon. And I get a free copy of this for PC as well. So I might get my graphics card before Christmas. Which means I can actually play this before um, Christmas on the PC and then once I've done it I can play on the PlayStation afterwards. Um, I do prefer playing Assassin's Creed on the PlayStation. I've always played Assassin's Creed on the PlayStation even though I do own Unity on the PC. I have every other game on PlayStation 3. Um, so I do like my Assassin's Creed on PlayStation. It's kind of like this and Uncharted. Ser the Uncharted series is what I play on PlayStation and that's my PlayStation history pretty much over because I don't play anymore because um, PC is the best. But yeah. Okay guys, thank you for watching, um, please remember to like, share, comment, subscribe and let me know what you think of the collector's edition down below. I will put some nice pictures up if I can get some of the actual statue in a minute uh, and then add them into the end of the video. So yeah, let me know what you think down below and I will see you next time. and anything else that really need doing we'll do next episode so apart from that guys thank you for watching please remember to 